2020 paper 1 GCE the question on transformer the question goes as follows a step up transformer increases the voltage of an AC supply from 110 volts to 220 volts the primary core dispatches a power of 1.1 kilowatts and the transformer has an efficiency of 100%. So let's correct the data. So this one will be our VP voltage passing through the primary core. Then this one will be our VS. The voltage that is passing through the secondary coil, which is 220 volts. And the, we are dealing with the ideal transformer, which has efficiency of 100%. But A. If the number of turns in the primary coil is 400, how many turns are in the secondary coil? So if we have uh, NP with 400 turns, what is NS? What is the number of turns to the secondary coil? Okay, so the formula we are going to apply here is Vs over Vp equal to Ns over Np. So our Vs it's 220 over Vp it's 110 equal to NS is our subject over NP 400. So we close multiply. NS times 110, it will be 110 NS equal to 220 times 400. It's 8,000. It's eight eight thousand so we divide both sides by one ten so eleven into eight eight it's eight then we add the zeros. So it is going to be 800 tens. Eight hundred tens is our answer. We go to part B. How much current flows in the primary coil? How much coil how much current flows in the primary coil so that's part b so they want us to find ip so now to find ip we have uh, power passing through the primary coil which is 1.1 kilowatts so if we convert this one in two watts it is going to be so kilo we know that it's one thousand so one thousand times one point one it will be one thousand one hundred watts then we have uh, and we have voltage passing through the primary core which is uh, 110 so vp 
equal to 110 volts so to find IP it will be very easy because we are going to apply this formula power equal to voltage times Z current so we have PP we have VP and IP so where there is PP we are going to replace 1100 1100 equal to VP it's 110 then IP is our subject so we divide both sides by 110 so this will go so IP equal to 11 into 11 it's 1 plus this is 0 so it will be 10 10 amps is the current question 2 secondary coil the current that is passing to the secondary coil IS so now to find IS we have uh, PP which is equal to 1100 watts and we have uh, VS which is equal to 220 220 volts so we can apply this formula power passing through the primary coil equal to power passing through the secondary coil so it will be PP equal to PS the same as light in VS times Z IS so now where there is PP we are going to replace 1100 equal to VS we have 220 times IS so we have to divide both sides by 220 so this will cancel IS will be equal to 220 to 1100 it's 5 amps so it's the current passing through the secondary coil thank you for watching this is mr Marenga e don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel and to share the video